right, guys, let's make some crab cakes tonight. We've got our mise en place all set up here. Um, so let's get started building our crab cakes. All right, first step for each pound of crab meat, you need one egg. Let's crack that in our bowl. For each pound, about a tablespoon of mayonnaise. Do a couple of shots of Worcestershire sauce. I don't know, about a tablespoon or so of Old Bay. Juice of half a lemon. These are kind of monstrous lemons, so maybe not quite the whole half juice. Now we're just gonna whisk this all up together till we get a nice smooth consistency. Now we're gonna add our crab meat. Now I'm not gonna lie, I'm using claw meat because crab is so expensive these days. But what you want to do is you want to pull your crab out little bits at a time. You don't want to break it up too much, but you want to feel through it for any pieces of shell that may be in there. And if you find them, just set them. Crab is in. We only found a couple of pieces of shell, which is good. Now, before we actually mix this all up, we're going to add just a couple of tablespoons of panko. All right. Crab cakes, you want to keep real simple. You don't want a lot of filler, but you need just a little bit of panko to help it stay together as a cake when you pick, mix it all up here in a minute. Gently fold this all together, trying not to break up your crab meat any more than necessary. All right, once it's all mixed together good, we're going to take and we're going to form some crab cakes out of this, okay? I, um, I'm going to make smaller crab cakes but you just want to gently squeeze them together into a round ball. Pan with a tablespoon or two of olive oil in it here. Uh, we've got it on medium high heat. Once it's good and hot, we're gonna take our crab cakes. We're just gonna gently press them out and lay them down. Uh, I ended up getting seven crab cakes that are two and a half to three ounces a piece out of this recipe for the size I'm making. So I am going to just Make sure I get a little coating of this panko all around the outside, gently patting them together. I'm going to do four and three. Uh, I don't want to overcrowd the pan here. Now we're going to let these cook for about three minutes on each. All right, guys, we've got about two, three minutes on this side, and we're just going to gently flip over in the pan. All right, guys, now that we've had about three minutes on the other side, we're going to go ahead and pull these out. Put them on a sheet pan and just set them aside for a few minutes. All of our crab cakes are now done sauteing on both sides. We're going to throw them in a 400 degree oven for about five, six minutes just till they're uh, heated all the way through. Our crab cakes are all done in the oven. We're going to go ahead and slide two crab cakes on each plate where we've got some corn that we've cooked on the stove to go with it. And we've got some homemade cocktail sauce uh, on the table already. To but as always, give it a try, and I hope you enjoy.